Hello there, my name is Zero in on Alex. You can call me Zero, you can call me Alex, whatever you choose. I have decided to start a YouTube channel all about Super Smash Brothers, and what a better way to start than recently with the recent release of Joker from the Persona series, specifically Persona 5, which is a magnificent game if you haven't tried it out. It is a must play. Granted, there are rumors around that Persona 5 might be coming to Switch, Persona 5S, put two and two together. Anywho, let's get right into the tutorial. So when it comes to Joker, I think he's pretty busted. I've played with him for a couple hours since he was released. I was actually one of the few people on Twitter to actually get him pretty early on. Um, but yeah, he's got, his moveset is incredible. As you probably have seen already on his name, you see a little bit of a bar filling up. He's kind of like Cloud in that sense where he has a limit, I would say. I'm gonna call it a limit meter. The thing, the difference is, it builds up over time. I could literally sit here and it's gonna start filling up. The best way to fill it up is through actual combat battle, and I'll kind of get into that, but let's go over his basic moveset. So Joker has an up tilt, where he throws his dagger up in the air, down tilt, where he slides, and then his forward tilts, which he just does a couple stabs real quick, okay? Then he's got up smash, down smash, forward smash, which is the same as the other way. Okay, so all of his attacks are definitely used with his dagger, which I kind of like. Of course, he's got a good dash. I think he's got a pretty good dash speed. You can dash dance a little bit, you know. Go into slides. So then, now we have his aerials. He's got neutral air. I feel like that does a good amount of coverage. It's not as broken as Ike's is, even though Ike has fallen off a little bit in popularity. But it's still pretty good coverage. You do a short hop, you know. It's pretty safe. Uh, you have back air, and you have forward air, and you have up air. His up air is ridiculous. I love that thing. It just does the little kick thing. You know, his forward air definitely can. That was a back air. See? Back air. And then you can go for certain attacks. So yeah, up air, down air. Oh, no. Up tilt, down tilt, forward tilt, back tilt, same thing. Up air, down air, neutral air. Forward air, back air, down smash, <laughs> I'm like beating the crap out of him, up, smash, <laughs> I feel like I'm forgetting the name, I just get so excited about Joker. So those are his basic moves. Now the thing that I was saying earlier that makes Joker so special, oh, I also forgot his specials, he's got side special. Now this is really cool, because it does a little bit of damage over time, it's not the greatest thing, but for a little chip damage, and for a little bit of edge guarding, it can work really well for you, but what works even better uh, also, he's got his up special, which, in, <laughs> if I'm being honest, is a little ridiculous. Um, and I'll show you why real quick, and then we'll kind of get into the, uh, we'll get into the R scene, or the R sen. So, Joker has an interesting up air, because, or his up special, because he has the grappling hook, which, as you can see, can actually do damage to the opponent at pretty good ranges. Look at this. So you don't always have to be directly up, up angled at him. As you can see, I'm like past him at this part and it still grabs him. And then you can go, you know, tech chasing. Anywho, so the thing that kind of makes this a little busted is first of all, the range. You're over here, boom. And that's not even the full extent of the range. I've seen it longer. Let me see how long I can go. Nope, that's still pretty short. Yeah, that's still pretty short. I'm still grabbing, oh, I died in that one. But his range is ridiculous when it comes to this thing. Look at that. You see that? And what makes it even worse, or in this case better, if you like busted moves, is let's say you've, you're you being thrown off and you haven't used your double jump yet, which you shouldn't anyways. You can, what you can do, let's say you aim the wrong way. You can jump and then do it again. And you could actually make it. And that actually happened between me and a buddy of mine where I got knocked off, and I aimed it the wrong way, I jumped, and then I made it. That one would probably be a bad example because you're pointing it the wrong way, but if you at least point it in somewhat, like if you over here, oh, I had jumped already. Like that. See how I aimed it the wrong way? I, it's very niche, but it's nice to know that you can still do it after the fact. So that kind of covers the basics of Joker in normal mode, other than his regular special is guns, I'm holding the button, or you can tap it. It does seem that tapping it is faster. 
than just holding it. So what makes Joker special? Well, that would be his Rebel's Guard. It's a counter that lasts a lot longer <laughs> than most counters. But anywho, let's get Bowser down here because we're going to need Bowser's help because this is what really unlocks Bowser's, oh, uh, this is what unlocked Joker's ridiculous attacks. So as you can see, the meter has filled up, Arsene, his persona, is out, and this is where all of his attacks that I've just shown you have become OP. Is up, look at this. You can combo him into the oblivion with this. The damage that his aerials do is insane. See? Now the meter does obviously, you know, slow down, but some of his attacks do change. For example, let's get back to the point where we can get it. This is one of those times where I really wish I had a friend with me. So, as you can see, our scene is out again. Let's check out, so you've seen his attacks, all his attacks get busted, buffs and whatnot, but his specials change quite a bit. So side special, which was the little thing that does damage, now has that type of effect. It's kind of like a L fire. So it's really good for edge guarding. So that's pretty cool. Um, his up special, his range, is ridiculous. <laughs> it is absolutely ridiculous what this man can do. Um, we need another one. We need another side smash Bowser. All right. So as you can see, it was kind of in, like it was instant. So Bowser's following off uh, uh, side smashes. But the thing that makes this interesting is his counter. His counter can actually counter projectiles and physical attacks. And let me tell you, is it a strong one? I need Bowser to come back down here. Bowser, I need you down here, buddy. Come on, give me a one, give me one. You see that? You see that, a fully charged smash attack just obliterated him. Again, this works with projectiles too. So it's pretty safe to say that when Arsene is out, see, now granted, when you do counter, you do take half damage. So it's, it feels like risk versus reward, but it really isn't. <laughs> like I said, his range, his attacks, everything about him just becomes busted. There, You feel so safe to go out because you can toss him and you can chase him, go off ledge, and if you were scared before to give it a shot, boom. And you're invincible, so you can't get spiked during that. You Mario players who love to spike won't be able to do that anymore. So like I said, and then look at that. You see how long I held that for? It is ridiculous what he can do. It is absolutely insane. All his attacks, like I said, become more powerful. And that's kind of like the gist of Joker. When it comes to playing Joker, it is a little bit of a game of who can get our scene first or our send first. But the things that he can do, the power that he has, He's definitely going to be a favorite for a long time. You see that? See how I almost made it from death. And it, thanks to Bowser, I think he hit me. And that's what allowed me to survive. And that's kind of the gist of Joker. He is unstoppable when it comes to Arsene. And that's kind of the basic rundown that you need to know for Joker. Again, this is not an in-depth tutorial. If you would like an in-depth tutorial when it comes to combos, multiple moves you can do together, uh, certain texts you can do, anything like that, please let me know. This is a YouTube channel I've been wanting to start for a very long time. If there's something I did not explain well, because again, this is my first YouTube channel when it comes to Smash Bros, please leave it in the comments below. Let me know what you want to see, what you want to hear, something, maybe another tutorial about Joker, maybe a tutorial about another character you would like to see. I hope you enjoyed this. This is your moment to be zeroed in on Alex.